The Indo-Aryan or Indic languages is the dominant language family of the Indian subcontinent. They constitute a branch of the Indo-Iranian languages, itself a branch of the Indo-European language family. In the early 21st century, Indo-Aryan languages were spoken by more than 800 million people, primarily in India, Bangladesh, Nepal, Pakistan, and Sri Lanka. The largest in terms of speakers are Hindustani, Hindi Urdu, about 329 million, Bengali, 242 million, Punjabi, about 100 million, and other languages with a 2005 estimate placing the total number of native speakers at nearly 900 million. History Proto-Indo-Aryan Proto-Indo-Aryan, or sometimes Proto-Indic, is the reconstructed proto-language of the Indo-Aryan languages. It is intended to reconstruct the language of the pre-Vedic Indo-Aryans. Proto-Indo-Aryan is meant to be the predecessor of Old Indo-Aryan 1500 to 300 BCE which is directly attested as Vedic and Mitanni Aryan. Despite the great archaicity of Vedic, however, the other Indo-Aryan languages preserve a small number of archaic features lost in Vedic. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Indian subcontinent Proto-Indo-Aryan reconstructed Old Indo-Aryan CA 1500 to 300 BCE Early Old Indo-Aryan Vedic Sanskrit 1500 to 500 BCE Late Old Indo-Aryan Epic Sanskrit Classical Sanskrit 500 to 300 BCE Middle Indo-Aryan or Prakrits Old Odia CA 300 BCE to 1500 CE C Early Modern Indo-Aryan Late Medieval India Early Dakini and emergence of the Kariboli dialect Topic. Old Indo-Aryan The earliest evidence of the group is from Mitanni Indo-Aryan. The only evidence of it is a few proper names and specialized loanwords. Rigvedic Indo-Aryan has been used in the ancient preserved religious hymns of the Rigveda, the earliest Vedic literature. From the Rigvedic language, Sanskrit, literally put together, meaning perfected or elaborated developed as the prestige language of culture, science and religion, as well as the court, theatre, etc. Sanskrit is, by convention, referred to by modern scholars as classical Sanskrit in contradistinction to the so-called Rigvedic Sanskrit, which is largely intelligible to Sanskrit speakers. <laughs> Middle Indo-Aryan Outside the learned sphere of Sanskrit, vernacular dialects Prakrits continued to evolve. The oldest attested Prakrits are the Buddhist and Jain canonical languages Pali and Ardhamagadhi Prakrit, respectively. By medieval times, the Prakrits had diversified into various Middle Indo-Aryan languages. Apabramsa is the conventional cover term for transitional dialects connecting late Middle Indo-Aryan with early modern Indo-Aryan, spanning roughly the 6th to 13th centuries. Some of these dialects showed considerable literary production. The Sravakakara of Devasena, dated to the 930s, is now considered to be the first Hindi book. The next major milestone occurred with the Muslim conquests in the Indian subcontinent in the 13th-16th centuries. Under the flourishing Turko-Mongol Mughal Empire, Persian became very influential as the language of prestige of the Islamic courts due to adoption of the foreign language by the Mughal emperors. However, Persian was soon displaced by Hindustani. This Indo-Aryan language is a combination with Persian, Arabic, and Turkic elements in its vocabulary, with the grammar of the local dialects. The two largest languages that formed from Apabramsa were Bengali and Hindustani, others include Sindhi, Gujarati, Odia, Marathi, and Punjabi. <laughs> New Indo-Aryan Dialect continuum The Indo-Aryan languages of North India and Pakistan form a dialect continuum. What is called Hindi in India is frequently standard Hindi, the Sanskritized version of the colloquial Hindustani spoken in the Delhi area since the Mughals. However, the term Hindi is also used for most of the central Indic dialects from Bihar to Rajasthan. 
The spoken New Indo-Aryan dialects from Assam in the east to the borders of Afghanistan in the west form a linguistic continuum across the plains of North India, Pakistan and Bangladesh. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Medieval Hindustani. In the central zone Hindi speaking areas for a long time the prestige dialect was Braj Bhasha, but this was replaced in the 19th century by the Karaboli based Hindustani. Hindustani was strongly influenced by Sanskrit and Persian, with these influences leading to the emergence of modern standard Hindi and modern standard Urdu as registers of the Hindustani language. This state of affairs continued until the division of the British Indian Empire in 1947, when Hindi became the official language in India and Urdu became official in Pakistan. Despite the different script the fundamental grammar remains identical, the difference is more sociolinguistic than purely linguistic. Today it is widely understood, spoken as a second or third language throughout South Asia and one of the most widely known languages in the world in terms of number of speakers. <laughs> Mitanni Aryan Some theonyms, proper names and other terminology of the Mitanni exhibit an Indo-Aryan superstrate, suggest that a Indo-Aryan elite imposed itself over the Hurrians in the course of the Indo-Aryan expansion. In a treaty between the Hittites and the Mitanni, the deities Mitra, Varuna, Indra, and the Ashvins are invoked. Kikali's horse training text includes technical terms such as Ika, Eka, 1, Tara, Tri, 3, Panza, Pancha, 5, Sata, Sapta, 7, Na, Nava, 9, Vartana, Vartana, Turn, Round in the horse race. The numeral Ika, 1 is of particular importance because it places the superstrate in the vicinity of Indo-Aryan proper as opposed to Indo-Iranian or early Iranian which has AIVA in general another text has Babru Babru brown Parita Palita gray and Pinkara Pingala red their chief festival was the celebration of the solstice Vishuva which was common in most cultures in the ancient world the Mitanni warriors were called Maria, the term for warrior in Sanskrit as well. Note Mista Nnu equals Mizda, approximately equals Sanskrit Mita, payment for catching a fugitive. M. Merhofer, Etymologisches Wörterbuch des Altingdorischen, Heidelberg, 1986 to 2000, volume 2, 358. Sanskritic interpretations of Mitanni royal names render Artashamara Artasamara as Rasmara, who thinks of Urta. Merhofer 2 780, Buradashva Buradasua, Buriyasua as Pritisha, whose horse is dear. Merhofer 2 182, Priyamazda Priyamazda as Priyameta, whose wisdom is dear. Merhofer 2 189, I I 378, Sitrarata as Sitraratha, whose chariot is shining. Merhofer I 553, Indaruda, Endaruda as Indroda, helped by Indra. Merhofer I-134, Shadavaza Sadawaza as Sativaha, winning the race prize. Merhofer II-540, 696, Sabandu as Sabandu, having good relatives. A name in Palestine, Merhofer II-209, 735, Tushrata, Tuasarada, Tusrata, etc. as asterisk Tuayasaratha, Vedic T Vastar, whose chariot is vehement. Merhofer, Etym. WB, I-686, I-736. Romani, Lomavran, and Domari languages Domari Domari is an Indo-Aryan language spoken by older Dom people scattered across the Mina. The language is reported to be spoken as far north as Azerbaijan and as far south as central Sudan, in Turkey, Iran, Afghanistan, Pakistan, India, Iraq, Palestine, Israel, Jordan, Egypt, Sudan, Libya, Tunisia, Algeria, Morocco, Syria and Lebanon. Based on the systematicity of sound changes, we know with a fair degree of certainty that the names Domari and Romani derive from the Indo-Aryan word Dom. Lomavran Lomavran is a nearly extinct mixed language, spoken by the Lom people, that arose from language contact between a language related to Romani and Domari and the Armenian language. <laughs> Romani The Romani language is usually included in the Western Indo-Aryan languages. Romani 
spoken mainly in various parts of Europe, is conservative in maintaining almost intact the Middle Indo-Aryan present tense person concord markers, and in maintaining consonantal endings for nominal case, both features that have been eroded in most other modern languages of Central India. It shares an innovative pattern of past tense person concord with the languages of the Northwest, such as Kashmiri and Sheena. This is believed to be further proof that Romani originated in the Central region, then migrated to the Northwest. There are no known historical documents about the early phases of the Romani language. Linguistic evaluation carried out in the 19th century by Pott 1845 and Miklosic 1882 to 1888 showed that the Romani language is to be classed as a new Indo-Aryan language, Mia, not Middle Indo-Aryan, Mia, establishing that the ancestors of the Romani could not have left India significantly earlier than AD 1000. The principal argument favoring a migration during or after the transition period to NIA is the loss of the old system of nominal case, and its reduction to just a two-way case system, nominative versus oblique. A secondary argument concerns the system of gender differentiation. Romani has only two genders masculine and feminine. Middle Indo-Aryan languages named Mia generally had three genders masculine, feminine and neuter, and some modern Indo-Aryan languages retain this old system even today. It is argued that loss of the neuter gender did not occur until the transition to Nia. Most of the neuter nouns became masculine while a few feminine, like the neuter Agni, Agni in the Prakrit became the feminine Aga ag in Hindi and Jag in Romani. The parallels in grammatical gender evolution between Romani and other Nia languages have been cited as evidence that the forerunner of Romani remained on the Indian subcontinent until a later period, perhaps even as late as the 10th century. Topic. Classification There can be no definitive enumeration of Indic languages because their dialects merge into one another. The major ones are illustrated here, for the details, see the dedicated articles. The classification follows Masika and Kausen Dardic Kashmiri 5.6 million speakers Sheena Sheena 500,000 speakers Broxcat 10,000 speakers Domaaki 340 speakers Kundal Shahi 700 speakers Kalkoti 6,000 speakers Ushoji 2,000 speakers Palula 10,000 speakers Savi 3,000 speakers Pashayi 400,000 speakers Kuna Dameli 5,000 speakers Gawar Bati 9,500 speakers Nongalami 5,000 speakers Shumashti 1,000 speakers Chaitral Kalasha 5,000 speakers Kaur 290,000 speakers Kohastani Maya 200,000 speakers Pateri 29,000 Chiliso 1,000 speakers Gauro 200 speakers Kalami 100,000 speakers Tirahi 100 speakers Torwali 80,000 speakers Wodapuri Katarkali Topic. Northern Zone Central Pahari Garwali 2.9 million speakers Kumaoni 2.4 million speakers Eastern Pahari Nepali 17 million speakers Jumli 85,000 Topic Northwestern Zone Dagri 4 million speakers Himachali Kangri 1.1 million speakers Mandili 1.7 million Jansari 100,000 speakers Kulu 110,000 Pahari Kanauri 6,300 speakers Mahasu Himachali 1 million speakers Hindori 30,000 speakers Surmori 400,000 speakers Punjabi Punjabi 122 million speakers Dobi Landa Saraiki 20 million speakers Hinko 3.7 million speakers Jakati Pathwari 2.5 million speakers Maji Malwai Pwadasindi 
Sindhi 25 million speakers Jajali 25,000 speakers Kuchi 873,000 speakers Luwati 5,000 speakers Memoni Topic. Western Zone Ethnologue lists the following languages under the Western Zone that are not already covered in other subgroups Rajasthani Rajasthani proper 25.8 million speakers Bagri 2.1 million speakers Marwari 22 million speakers Miwadi 3 million speakers Dandari 9.6 million speakers Harauti 4.7 million speakers Mawari 5. 1 million speakers Shekawadi 3 million speakers Bagri 2.1 million speakers Dotki 150,000 speakers Malvi 5.6 million speakers Gujarati Gujarati 49 million speakers Jandavra 5,000 speakers Saurashtra 190,000 speakers Air 100 speakers Vagri 10,000 speakers Vasavi 1.2 million speakers Kohli 1.4 million speakers Parkari Kohli 250,000 speakers Kachi Kohli 500,000 speakers Wardiara Kohli 542,000 speakers Bull Northern Bhil Borea 27,000 speakers Billori 200,000 speakers Magari Central Bhil B. Healy proper 3.5 million speakers Balali 1.1 million speakers Chodra 210,000 speakers Dodia 170,000 speakers Donkey 140,000 speakers Dubli 250,000 speakers Borelli Palia Borelli 10,000 speakers Pauri Borelli 640,000 speakers Rathwi Borelli 100,000 speakers Party 49,000 speakers Kalto 15,000 speakers Kandeshi 1.9 million speakers Domari 4 million speakers Romani 1.5 million speakers Northern Romani Sinte Romani 200,000 speakers Carpathian Romani 160,000 speakers Finnish Kalo 12,000 speakers Baltic Romani 35,000 speakers Balkan Romani 560,000 speakers VLAX Romani 540,000 speakers Topic. Central Zone Madhya or Hindi. Parya 4,000 speakers Western Hindi Hindustani including standard Hindi and standard Urdu 329 million speakers Braj 21 million speakers Haryanvi 8 million speakers Bundeli 3.1 million speakers Kano G 9.5 million speakers Eastern Hindi Awadi 3.5 million speakers Fiji Hindi 460,000 speakers Bagheli 8.4 million speakers Chhattisgarhi 24 million speakers Peria historically belonged to the central zone but lost intelligibility with other languages of the group due to geographic distance and numerous grammatical and lexical innovations. Topic: <laughs> Eastern Zone. These languages derive from Magadhana Pabramsa Prakrit. Bihari Bhojpuri 40 million speakers Caribbean Hindustani 166,000 speakers Magahi, Magahi 14 million speakers Maithili, Maithili, Maithili 33.9 million speakers Anjika, Anjika, Anjika 743,000 speakers Kortha 8.04 million speakers Nagpuri 5.1 million speakers Kermali 556,089 speakers Taru 1.9 million speakers Odia Oria 33 million speakers Halbik Halbi 600,000 speakers Batri 220,000 speakers Kamar 40,000 speakers Mergan 60,000 speakers 
Nahari 20,000 speakers Bengali Assamese Banla Assamia Assamese Assamia 15 million speakers Bengali Banla 268 million speakers 40 to 60 million native speakers Bishnupriya Manipuri Bishnupriya Manipuri 120,000 speakers Chakma 330,000 speakers Silati Chalati 11 million speakers Chittagonian Kamtagamia 16 million speakers Rohingya Rohingya 1 8 million speakers KRNB Koka Rajabanzi Rampuri Kamada topic Southern Zone Languages This group of languages developed from Maharashtri Prakrit It is not clear if Dakini Dakani Southern Urdu is part of Hindustani along with Standard Urdu or a separate Persian influenced development from Marathi Topic. Marathi Konkani Marathi, Marathi 73 million speakers Fudagi 1000 speakers Kadodi Konkani 2.26 Konkani million speakers Kotkari 12000 speakers Kukna 110000 speakers Varli 600000 speakers Maharashtrian Konkani 2.4 million speakers Topic. Insular Indic Sinhalese, 17 million, Maldivian, 340,000 speakers, Mal, 10,000 speakers. The Insular Indic languages share several characteristics that set them apart significantly from the continental languages. Topic. Unclassified The following languages are related to each other, but otherwise unclassified within Indo-Aryan. Kuswarik Danwar 46,000 speakers Boat Darai 20,000 speakers Chinali Lahul Lohar Chinali 750 speakers Lahul Lohar 750 speakers The following other poorly attested languages are listed as unclassified within the Indo-Aryan family by Ethnologue 17. Kanjari, Punjabi, Odd, Marathi, Vagri Buli, Andh, Kumali, perhaps in Central, also Digaru, Mina, Balay, and Gaulan are all names for the Gauli caste, rather than a language. Kolosi The Kolosi language is a more recently discovered Indo-Aryan language spoken in two villages in southern Iran and remains currently unclassified. Topic. Phonology Topic. Consonants Topic. Stop positions The normative system of New Indo-Aryan stops consists of five points of articulation, labial, dental, retroflex, palatal, and velar, which is the same as that of Sanskrit. The retroflex position may involve retroflexion, or curling the tongue to make the contact with the underside of the tip, or merely retraction. The point of contact may be alveolar or postalveolar, and the distinctive quality may arise more from the shaping than from the position of the tongue. Palatal stops have affricated release and are traditionally included as involving a distinctive tongue position blade in contact with hard palate. Widely transcribed as masika claims C to be a more accurate rendering. Moving away from the normative system, some languages and dialects have alveolar affricates TS instead of palatal, though some among them retain in certain positions, before front vowels especially, I, before, J, or when geminated. Alveolar as an additional point of articulation occurs in Marathi and Konkani where dialect mixture and others factors upset the aforementioned complementation to produce minimal environments, in some West Pahari dialects through internal developments asterisk t, t, greater than, and in Kashmiri. The addition of a retroflex affricate to this in some Dardic languages maxes out the number of stop positions at 7 barring borrowed, q, while a reduction to the inventory involves asterisk ts greater than, s, which has happened in Assamese, Chittagonian, Sinhala, though there have been other sources of a secondary, ts, and southern Mawari. 
Further reductions in the number of stop articulations are in Assamese and Romani, which have lost the characteristic dental – retroflex contrast, and in Chittagonian, which may lose its labial and velar articulations through sprintization in many positions greater than f -x. Topic. Nasals Sanskrit was noted as having five nasal stop articulations corresponding to its oral stops, and among modern languages and dialects Dagri, Kachi, Kalasha, Rudari, Sheena, Sarasthtri, and Sindhi have been analyzed as having this full complement of phonemic nasals per meter, n, with the last two generally as the result of the loss of the stop from a homorganic nasal plus stop cluster j greater than, and greater than, though there are other sources as well. Topic. Charts The following are consonant systems of major and representative New Indo-Aryan languages, as presented in Masika 1991 though here they are in IPA. Parentheses indicate those consonants found only in loanwords, square brackets indicate those with very low functional load. The arrangement is roughly geographical. Topic. Language and dialect In the context of South Asia, the choice between the appellations language and dialect is a difficult one, and any distinction made using these terms is obscured by their ambiguity. In one general colloquial sense, a language is a developed dialect, one that is standardized, has a written tradition and enjoys social prestige. As there are degrees of development, the boundary between a language and a dialect thus defined is not clear-cut, and there is a large middle ground where assignment is contestable. There is a second meaning of these terms, in which the distinction is drawn on the basis of linguistic similarity. Though seemingly a proper linguistic sense of the terms, it is still problematic. Methods that have been proposed for quantifying difference for example, based on mutual intelligibility have not been seriously applied in practice, and any relationship established in this framework is relative. Topic. Language comparison chart Note, Hindi and Urdu is in the same column as well as Chittagonian and Rohingya, Topic. Interrogative pronouns Topic. Personal pronouns Topic. Numerals Topic. See also Indo-Aryans Iranic languages Indo-Aryan migration Proto-Vedic continuity the family of Brahmic scripts Linguistic history of the Indian subcontinent Indo-Aryan loanwords in Tamil Languages of Bangladesh Languages of India Languages of Pakistan Languages of Nepal References Further reading Topic. External links The Indo-Aryan Languages, October 25, 2009 The Indo-Aryan Languages Colin P. Masika Survey of the Syntax of the Modern Indo-Aryan Languages Rajesh Bhatt, February 7, 2003